you're watching 1700. Uh, this is Steph and Kate. Now, we are joined this afternoon by Livingstone. Thanks so much for joining us, guys. Ooh. Livingstone, even. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Too much sleepovering. <laughs> <laughs> so excited to have you guys in. Yeah, yeah, today. Welcome us. to our sleepover, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Really so good it. to so be here. And now, you just uh, recorded a new single, One Up. That's right, yeah? Yeah. Would you like right. to tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, so we just released it online, which is pretty cool. It's our first release, so it's very exciting. Um, yeah, and it's one of the first songs we ever wrote together, so it's really cool to finally have it out there for people to hear. And what's the reception been like so far with the song? Yeah, it's been pretty good, actually. Like, really surprised. Mm. Um, <laughs> like, we've gotten, like, a... Thought we nice. Well, yeah, well, not, not that didn't well. expect it to go <laughs> anywhere, <laughs> really. Like, um, no. no, we've got, like, a couple of community radio stations playing it, and... We've had play on Triple J and stuff too, so um, yeah, no, like we're stoked. Like never really thought like a you know one single could kind of push us forward so much. So yeah, yeah it's exciting. Like Have you had a situation where you've been in the car and it's come off on the radio and you've just turned the volume up and been like, woo? <laughs> <laughs> no, not Are yet. Are you still we're waiting for that moment? Yeah, we're waiting for that moment. Yeah. Maybe come. we should like trigger a CD and pretend that that's happening. Yeah. Yeah. I think yeah, that's yeah, a really yeah. good yeah. idea. Definitely yeah. should. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, you, you guys from Sydney and you've driven up, so maybe on the ride back. You could Ooh. just loop your single. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like fun. No, you really messed up in that bar, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, now, um, your music, uh, people have said it sort of combines a lot of different genres. It's very like soul influenced, but you can hear like some other kinds of genres in there. Um, where did your sound kind of originate from? Yeah. Um, We're all about good questions here it's on kind our of, 1700. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like all five of us have a really um, uh, a different... Like a unique sort of background. Well, yeah, all visually. different backgrounds and none of us really share too much territory um, in terms of inf influences and that sort of thing. So when we all came together, it just came out the, the way it did. We, none of us really expected it to. So yeah, yeah, we're pretty happy with it. And I'm interested to know, because you said this is sort of the first song um, that you guys have written together. Um, there's obviously five of you. What is your songwriting process like? Yeah, it's pretty, I think the easiest way to describe it is it's pretty organic. Like yep. it's sort of someone will come with an idea and then it's like, you almost hand it over to the band and kind of it just ends up taking the shape that you never expected. So I don't think any of us could write these songs alone, if you know what I mean. Like it's none of us are like individual songwriters team effort mm -hmm. yeah definitely yeah. yeah yeah beautiful yeah i think it's so exciting you can really hear the kind of like collaborative elements in the song and it's almost got like like two separate sections that are quite different which i liked a lot yeah yeah i think that also comes from the fact that the song was actually written over a long period so beautiful we're um, really keen to hear a little bit more right now though we're going to go to color bomb and that Stay song tuned. they're going to play. <laughs> Stay tuned. Welcome back to 1700. We've got the uh, babes, if I can say that, the babes from Livingstone <laughs> in the studio <laughs> with us. Really? No, I don't oh. believe that. Thank you. I don't believe the that. The first before. of many. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, so I'm keen to know, because um, you guys are obviously on a bit of tour at the moment, um, festival season's kind of coming up, and I want to know what your dream gig like what your dream festival would be to perform at it's a tough question Probably i know different but for all of us i reckon yeah you know yeah, yeah, yeah. anyone got one come to mind uh, i'm gonna say coachella yeah because like we're freaking huge so of course we're gonna <laughs> 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 that's a pretty good yeah good place to set <laughs> the bar summer? Mm -hmm. yeah yeah totally yeah um, yeah Make a 13 year old boy in me wants to um, play Soundwave. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine living oh, in Soundwave? Uh, uh, you know, disrupt the flow. I, yeah. I, that'd be kind of awesome, actually. <laughs> and the country superstar in me wants to play like CMT Crossroads. <laughs> 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 right next to the earth. Yeah. You were lying Tamworth about eclectic influences. Oh, I lived in Tamworth for a while. Did you go really? to the Tamworth Festival? It's everywhere, so you're in it. So you yeah. can't not be at the festival. The one time I went to Tamworth, I was like a week like after it was happening. I was not oh. happy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's good. That yeah. You it. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, well. Um, so you guys have been doing a residency up in Sydney at the Captain Cook. Yeah. Uh, how's that been, sort of playing the same place every week for, it's a month I believe, of September? Yeah. How's it been right. sort of uh, doing each week and coming back to the same venue? 
it's been I think it's been good for us because mm. we actually like the coolest thing about it was that we kind of treated it like a live mixtape like we got to choose the bands that played with us oh cool so every week it was like a fresh gig you know what I mean and like we got different crowds every week too depending on what bands were playing so it was actually good to kind of test our music on different crowds so it didn't feel like the same venue even hey because like, mm-hmm. there's such different people yeah. in it every week yeah. Um, and we are going to hear a, a live track from you guys in a moment, but um, I want to know because you guys have such a fun rhythm to your music, and I want to know kind of like what live bands that you enjoy seeing on stage. Totally, like local kind of acts. Or anyone? Like, um, is there any anyone that you've seen perhaps recently that you've gone? That energy on stage is just fabulous, and I, I want to embody that kind of energy on stage or something. It's tricky because yeah, it is. I reckon it's fully different for all of us. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's what we were saying. We come from. We all come from such different backgrounds. Mm-hmm. Like Dom was in a pop punk band, and like so Green Day obviously is my. Life. <laughs> 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 that's I awesome. Live when I was like twelve or thirteen. Woo! Oh, Billy Joe Armstrong, like. Oh yeah, front men of life. <laughs> if you wanted to be a front man, you wanted to be Billy Joe Armstrong. So. Yeah, and like I kind of like depressing on stage vibes, like radio play, yeah. <laughs> which doesn't suit our music really. <laughs> but like, mm. so it's kind of you know all over the place. And then what's up next for you guys? Uh, I think you were thinking about releasing another single. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. releasing another one. I think around November, and um, and then early next year, I think we're going to drop the EP. Oh, so, uh, exciting! Yeah, exciting times. Mm. Yeah, both yeah. singles, like the one that we've just released and the one in November are going to be on the EP too. So, and how's yeah. recording been going? Uh, scattered. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like really hard. Like we're all pretty busy people. Like outside of um, this band, like we kind of work doing music too, like doing cover gigs and corporate stuff. Um, so to kind of get us all in one room at one time can sometimes be like a bit of a hassle. So we've been recording over like the last... I don't know, like three or four months. Yeah. Mm. And just, yeah, doing it really, really slowly, which is cool because then, like, um, you know, coming towards the end of this year, we've got, um, like, a bunch of new songs that we think would go well with the ones we've already written. So we can just record them a bit later, you know, and then chuck them into EP. So Beautiful. And yeah. we're going to hear a live track from you guys very soon, uh, right after this, so stick around. You're on 1700. <laughs> 